Hey guys, so I decided to start a like week in my life in quarantine. It's actually currently Tuesday. I didn't vlog yesterday, but it was like super gloomy out and I was just feeling crappy. So we are going to start the vlog off today because I'm feeling a lot, a lot better. As you can tell, my room looks very different if you knew what it looked like before. This is my childhood bedroom, so it says a lot. Um, hopefully my room transformation video is up before this. If it is, go check that video out. I'm so excited to be able to post it, but I'm not fully done my room yet, so yeah. But I thought I would vlog while I'm in quarantine and just kind of show you guys a week in my life. I'm just going to do like probably a few clips every day because I'm obviously not doing a ton of stuff because I am stuck inside. So yeah. And also, if you're wondering, I am not working this summer because my parents are older, so I can't really work. It's like a, definitely a big risk for them. So I am just kind of chilling at home. I'm going to be volunteering for Kids Help Phone soon, though. I'm just waiting for like training to be available. But yeah, I'm still going to be a productive member of society. <laughs> um, but yeah, and hopefully I can just focus on YouTube this summer. That'll be super fun. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Hey guys, so I know I started this video off few days ago and I haven't even vlogged since but I just haven't been doing stuff but I've been exhausted because I haven't been getting sleep at all like I've been going to sleep and I wake up at like 5 a.m. and I'm like wide awake and it's just really annoying but I slept through the night which is so nice and then I also had like a phone call doctor's appointment today just to talk about like mental health stuff and then what's it called um what I can do for my sleep because like I finally got sleep, but like that's not normal for me to get sleep, so yeah. But right now I'm doing the unimaginable. Something crazy. This is my makeup bag. I'm putting makeup on today. I haven't opened this makeup bag for I'm gonna say at least a month. Yeah, like it's been a long time. Um, but wait, let me open this up. I don't even remember how do you put makeup on? I don't know, <laughs> but I have this package from Cupshe, which is like a bikini brand. Um, I'm like working with them for this video to show my stuff, like my, show my stuff, wow, uh, to show the bikinis. Um, so I figured I might as well put a little bit of makeup on because this is what we've been looking like for like a month and a half, two months, you know, I'm gonna fix it a little bit. So I have makeup on now. I forgot what I looked like when I had makeup on. This is very weird. I feel... Wait, I want a face here. This is very weird. I have not worn makeup in so long, but yeah. That's what I look like today. This is a big change. Holy crap. Hey guys, so I just finished filming my try on bikini video. Here's a little sneak peek. I just tried on this like one piece one, which is doesn't really fit me that great. But yeah, I'm gonna have to, I told them that I would send the video that, well, <laughs> I told them that I would film it and send them like the unlisted video today so they can approve it. Um, so yeah, after I need to definitely edit so I can send that to them by tonight, which I think this will be pretty fast to edit, to be honest. I just haven't edited in a while, so it might take a sec. Okay, so I'm making an iced coffee, and if you're curious what I do, I fill up my cup, like, with a decent amount of ice, and then I have a Keurig, which is, like, an iced coffee button, and I've been using the Zavita Pumpkin Spice Coffee. I'm just gonna let that... That's what it looks like, I think... My mom ordered this off of Amazon, but this stuff is so good. So I just fill it up and click the iced coffee button. I just witnessed my mom <laughs> opening up the umbrella side to sit and drink her coffee. And then water just poured all over her and in her coffee from the umbrella. So... <laughs> All right, that is bad luck. <laughs> All right, it's very simple how I make this, but I might as well just show you guys. So I literally just add, I really don't like strong coffee, but I still like this somehow, but I add a pretty decent amount of milk 
And then I just add a splash of Curtis's 5% cream. Ew, why is it? Ew. I don't know if that smells weird. We're gonna use the other one. There's like no in between. Now this is 18% cream. I'm just gonna do a dash of this. I think that's like really thick cream. But I just go like that. And that is the coffee. Hey guys, so I'm doing the exact same thing today. I'm just laying in the sun. I definitely got very tanned. I'll show you guys in the mirror. My room is messy right now, but um, <laughs> that's what I'm looking like right now. I look somehow super dark. I don't really know how this happened. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just going to sit outside in my backyard, absorb the sun because it will be raining for the next like week. So yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, so I want to add in this section to the video. This is actually going to be sponsored. I did get some of this stuff for free, but all opinions are my own. Um, this is like a beauty or like skincare subscription box. It's of Korean beauty and I am so excited. Like this came with so many products. So it comes in this box. It's so, so cute. So it looks like this. It's called Skin Star. It says beautiful with Skin Star. Then you open it up oh, <laughs> and it looks like this. Um, it says, Skin Star recommends items that are essential to your skincare every month. Uh, we provide products that all skin can use safely with high quality and hypoallergenic ingredients. And we research for effective ingredients, oppose animal, exper <laughs> oppose animal experiments, and only care for skin health. So, we have got... Some products underneath here as you can see and then this bag is just stuffed with skincare products so I'm gonna go through all of it with you guys and then it also does come it will come like with this every month um, it comes with the like menu of the things that came in your subscription box so I got one two three four five six seven skincare products and I'm just like so excited to show you guys everything so I will pull each thing out and then I will read to you guys what it does. This is like the coolest idea because you literally get so many just like full size products. Like this is full size. Let me see if I can get this out. Like this is so big. <laughs> so I'm just going to read to you guys what the things are that came in the box. I just think this is such a cool idea to get some skincare. It's obviously like a super discounted price. Um, but this is the Pure Heels Propolis 80 Sleeping Mask. This is 100 grams and the sleeping mask with long-lasting moisture with propolis, whatever that is, ingredients that effectively moisturize the skin. So this is what this looks like. But yeah, this is just craziness. Oh, there's like a couple layers. So that's super exciting to try out. So if you can hear people talking downstairs, by the way, I am home, so I can't really help it. But the next thing I have is the Centella Sica Toner Pads. Um, this is a mild soothing pad that soothes sensitive skin with a high concentration. I can't talk today. A high concentration of Centella Toner. And then, yeah, this is just like pads. I am so excited to try this. And it's also brands that like I've never heard of, which is kind of nice because you actually get to try out different things. And it's not just like Sephora brands or drugstore. Like this is stuff from like... Korea and I'm just really excited to try it out <laughs> so yeah and the next thing you get this cute bag and then it's just stuffed with products I'll just yeah let you guys know what it is so I have this which is a pore clear black charcoal cleansing foam I didn't realize this was a cleanser I thought it was a mask but this is a one-step cleanser that washes the skin with premium charcoal powder and oriental plant ingredients and yeah this is what this looks like super excited and like everything's just so big like this is the size of my head i'm like this all this stuff's gonna last me so long so the next thing i have to show you guys is the essener black tea scrub this is a scrub containing black tea that cleanses and purifies pores and this also is like decently big everything is but yeah it looks like this i kind of think the packaging of this is kind of cute but yeah, it looks like that, and it's just a very huge jar. So the next thing I have is the Clive Ginseng Berry Premium Cream. This premium cream that enhances skin elasticity and strengthens skin in ginseng berry extract. 
and this is also just very big <laughs> i think i'm gonna try some of this stuff up tonight and i'll show you guys like the moisturizer or something like if i end up using it just so you guys can see my thoughts on it this packaging looks so like sleek looking and like a little bit bougie <laughs> And also, I forgot to mention that this whole box is valued at over $300, so I will have to look up how much each box is, though, because I did get sent this, so I'm not too sure. Um, the next thing that I have is the BRTC First Ample BB, uh, Ample BB Cream. The BB Cream that improves the elasticity and gloss of the skin by containing the patented Fermentox complex ingredient, whatever that means. So this is, yeah, a BB cream. I just, I'm a little confused as to what color this would be. I don't want to open it because I don't want to make it bad because it's quarantine and I'm not really wearing makeup, but I am pretty tanned right now. So we'll see if that works. And then I have one last thing to show you guys. And this is the Essenerb Tea Tree Ample, ample that prevents moisture loss and protects skin by containing tea tree ingredients. So show you guys this one. <laughs> oh, this is really cute packaging. This one it just looks like that. But yeah, I am very excited to try all this stuff out. I do have a little, little bit of makeup on right now. Like I put on a little bit of concealer because I am breaking out. But I will try some like moisturizer on tonight to see what I actually think about it. I just don't want to do it when I have like concealer on because that's just like kind of pointless. But yeah, thank you so much, Skinstar, for sending me these products. I am so excited, and just, like, even this packaging is so cute. Like, just, like, the cutest box. And it has this little cute thing there. But yeah, I'm really excited to try out all these products. It'll be nice to actually be able to, like, try out new skincare that I otherwise, like, would never have heard of. So, yeah, thank you very much, and I'm very excited to try this stuff out. Okay, I want to add this part into this video here because I feel like I'm gonna have to address it um so as you guys know I have been home I have been very quarantined like I'm like in prison in my house at this point <laughs> um yeah I've been at home well since school it's been like a month um but I have been quarantined quarantined for like two months I just like was at school before but I have not seen anybody and all that time and I am slowly losing my mind like a lot of mental breakdowns have been happening not gonna lie so my parents and I pretty much thought of a solution to make me not lose my mind and I feel like this could be controversial but I'm doing this in the most safe way and most like responsible way possible um, my boyfriend is going to be moving in with me but the way that we're doing this it will be very safe um, he's going to I'm gonna pick him up and he's going to get tested at a testing center and then we will be in my room quarantined away from my family until he gets his results back and then we will be able to be with my family which is the most safe way to do it we know that he doesn't have it then and then he can see my family I think that's the best way that it can be done and then that way it's like we're not not seeing each other for an unknown amount of months but yeah after he's quarantined here he's like staying here so I just wanted to address that because I know that people are going to know that like he obviously was not here and then he's gonna randomly be in my videos and I feel like people are gonna be like, what the hell? Cause I'm like super anti like the people that are going out and seeing their friends and stuff right now. I'm like, drives me absolutely mental. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to address that cause I feel like it could come off as being like really hypocritical, but I'm doing it responsibly. He's getting tested. I'm not just hanging out with him. Like we are, we will be quarantining together. He's getting tested and yeah, I just wanted to address that because I know I've like tweeted about it and stuff and like talked to people about it and I don't want to sound like hypocritical of being like oh my god people are wanting to see people that my boyfriend's moving in but like you just have to do stuff responsibly and like this is the most responsible way to do it my parents are like very like on the rules of this whole virus and like it was their idea that it would be okay and they're comfortable with it so I just wanted to throw that out there in case I get any comments of being like what the hell are you doing um yeah also my tan looks tragic because this is <laughs> this is white <laughs> and then you look at this part of my arm and I look extremely tanned also my face is kind of white but like crazy tanned and then it's like wow she hasn't seen the outdoors so I just need to tan the inside of my arms clearly um but yeah I just wanted to say that so that I was not hypocritical and then also like you know I'm not stupid I promise <laughs> I just wanted it to pop in here at the end because I never actually finished off this vlog sorry this vlog was 
all over the place but in quarantine I didn't have that much to film so just kind of like the very odd day I filmed that's over like the span of probably like three weeks what you guys just saw um but yeah I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one bye guys